thing. Here's the thing. Let me tell you. Alrighty. Alrighty. I'm doing a puzzle. Here's my wine wall. Mine is the wine. Edward's sleeping, look. He doesn't want me to wake him up. Hi, buddy. How are you? You guys, we miss the kitties so much. I'm so happy to be, oh, hi, baby boy. All right, I'll let you go. He likes sleeping on the windowsill. There's Katie. Katie did a hair wrap yesterday with her friends Kyla and Molly. It looks beautiful. I really like, did you pick the colors? Yeah. They're very beachy. Yeah. I like it. It's boy, excellent. So I want to get, are any stores open where I can go get string? I don't think so. I think we have to order it. Here's actually, the here's the thing. Here's actually, the thing. Let me tell you. Okay. So we get money on our cards mm -hmm. every month so that when we go get food with our friends or do things that we need money for, we're not constantly asking for money. So we're allotted $50 that we can choose to spend on like so we have to decide when to spend it and like what to spend it on. Manage your money. Mm -hmm. Manage your money. And so oftentimes I don't spend the whole $50 in the month. So it like adds up. In a nutshell, I needed a new strap for my shark watch. So I ordered one and it was like $15 plus shipping. It was like $20. So that's $20. Then I was getting, I'm getting my boater's license and the fee is $44. So I paid that $44 off my card too. Then I may have bought a crepe yesterday that was like $5. So now I'm at a grand total of $0. Called <laughs> managing your money. Uh, yeah. Yes, but I, yeah. Yeah. So you decide like how you want to spend yeah. your money. So now I have no money left. Okay. So, um, yeah. I've well, been there. I've been there and then I have to deal. wait until I can do it again. At least I'm not, at least it wasn't because it used to be all in food. Remember? Yes. Yes. And every day I would just get like food because I want, like not because I needed it, just because I was like, it's it's a to do. get food. Right. right. So, uh, I feel like, I feel like it did a pretty good job. You know, yeah. I'm a shark watch. I'm proud of that. Same I don't regret that. that. Mm -hmm. Uh, boater's license going to be worth it once I can take out the boat, take out Hopefully a jet ski one, which I really want to get. Really <laughs> and uh, so there's that. And then the crepe, um, I ended up giving that to Ryan. <laughs> he didn't even eat it. He didn't eat it? No, you didn't even oh, eat it. Oh, I, I didn't said. eat it. But yeah. I gave it to Ryan, and it made me feel good that I fed my brother. Oh, that's so nice of you to feed your brother. So now I have no money. Okay. I just have... Well, what's today? May what? 18th? 16th, 17th. 17th? So you have 13 more days. You can get a job. <laughs> All right, so I'll take you around and show you what I'm doing. Oh my Here's my wine wall. Mine is the wine. We're gonna change that, you guys. So many things have happened while we were away, and um, we sort of just stopped our life right in the middle, like so many people did when you um, started quarantining. So one of the things was right before we left, Mike and I were building our new closet or installing our new closet. So I wanted to show you what I'm doing now to sort of finish up that project. Um, and, oh, my new glasses. You guys, that's right. So I ordered new glasses. You guys helped me pick these out and this got the most votes, by the way. These are the red ones from Warby Parker. So I had ordered those right before we left for Florida and they came in like, I don't know, three or four days later, and they've been sitting here waiting for me. So I love them, I hope you like them. Um, I can see beautifully and never wearing them every day, so I think they're so fun. So thank you so much for helping me choose those. But let me show you what I'm working on right now with the closet. All right, so one thing is all my jewelry. Like I have all this jewelry and I don't want to use a jewelry box anymore. So I've ordered like a hanging jewelry organizer and it matches this and it's gonna go right here so I can open it up and put my jewelry there. Then I was able to, um, we finished putting this tower together and these two drawers. So we fit all of our clothes. I moved my shoes over here, sweatshirts and stuff like that over there. I'm gonna put purses. I just ordered some plastic storage bins to put my purses in. I have my suitcases over here. Here I'm gonna hang, so nobody can see them, but I know they're there. I'm hanging all my marathon medals. 
race and my running race medal, so I'm pretty excited about that. And then I'm gonna hang some hats, I think, up there, like some um, baseball caps. But this is what our, I don't know if you guys can see, but this is what our closet looks like now. And it is a thousand but gazillion times better than it used to be. Um, I do need to work on lighting. We do need to move that light switch over here somewhere. So I have an electrician come in to do that. I would like to get a runner, like a little um, like rug to go here, a carpet or I guess rug is what you call it. And I think we're gonna do maybe um, on here, I don't really wanna store things as much as I think I wanna just maybe put photos. And there, I would love to put a full mirror, but it's a diagonal. So I'm not exactly sure what to do there. I don't wanna order in like a custom mirror, cut glass, I, I'm not into all that expense. I don't wanna do that, something very simple. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do there. I might do the, the Ikea stick on like square mirror thing might be cool, or I might just leave it like that. Or I might, maybe I'll have Katie like stencil something. It might be kind of cool to have a saying or something there. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll have a saying. Oh, good idea, Jill. Okay, cool. So anyway, so I'm working on this right now. And I just, like I say, I ordered some bins for Target for pickup. So I'm gonna go pull up to Target and have some bins. Um, and I ordered some more hangers like for pants so they can go long. Um, so I'm pretty excited about how this is how this is working, how it's all coming together. And these are just sort of like all the things I have left to put away. Now, I will say this. I had all of this, not that, but all of this in my closet when I took it out. So I do have, this is like junk. It's like sewing stuff and um, like Katie's gymnastics medals and old, like, oh my gosh, is that more jewelry? Oh, for Pete's sake. This is like... I have the kids, um, some of the important kids stuff from school, like all the report cards and some of their writings from they, when they were kids. And I have like my, that's my jewelry making box right there. This is my hat box, which I think I'm going to get rid of. And this is that really, that was my Easter basket, but I don't really need that anymore. But this is my sewing kit. This is Katie. Like I can't bear to throw this away. Look at Katie designed this. Um, it's actually on one of our very, very first videos, but this is her future car I lifted F. 250 with flames on the side. I cannot get rid of that. But the funny thing is this, look at, she made that very same day, she made another design. This is someone else's dream car, a lifted yellow Volkswagen Beetle with rainbow flowers on the side. The funny thing is, I now have a yellow Volkswagen Beetle. I, it's not lifted and it doesn't have flowers on the side, but it's so funny that Kate, like of the two cars she drew, that's that. So she'll probably end up someday with a lifted Ford F-150. So I can't bear to get rid of those kind of things. I'm a little bit of a, I'm a little bit of a keepsaker. Like I, I don't like to get rid of things that are sentimental. Are you guys the same way? So, I don't know, comment down below. Let me know what you think about whether I should keep all this stuff. Alrighty, alrighty. So, um, we kind of had a boring day. I don't know if it's very exciting, but I'm doing I'm a doing puzzle. puzzle. Doing you should do a time lapse of your puzzle. Yeah, I'd be kind of tight. We did that kind of in Florida. We did that first puzzle. Cool. Um, also, I'm bringing puzzles back. It's not like they were ever a thing, but I'm bringing Bring them back in. Right. You know? Trend setter. I, oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, a trend, I'm, I'm gonna make puzzles trend. Yeah, cool. And not just between, like, old calories. Well, they already are trending because that was the last one at the store. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's a lot of people are doing puzzles now because they're, like, kind of stuck in their homes, but, yeah. Yeah. So, it's only a 500-piece puzzle because they didn't have a 1,000. I think I could order them online. Yeah, usually I usually do 5,000s, but, you know, it's my off day, so I'm just gonna take a chill and do 500. Yeah, it looks kind of easy. Yeah, it's pretty easy. Oh my goodness, you guys, it is late. It is 12.30 in the morning. I completely forgot to vlog. Katie going is say, saying goodnight and Brendan saying goodnight, but Ryan and I are doing... We're back on the puzzle grind. We are back on the puzzle grind and we can't stop. It's just so hard to stop because it's so much fun and it's such a challenge. So we're working on the outside pieces first. This is the puzzle. You might have shown it earlier. Did you already show it? Um, I think so. I think you should. Well, it it's, yeah, it's a bunch of cars. Because, I mean, it's a cool puzzle, but it, yeah, it's the only one we could find. Yeah. That mom could find because all of them are sold out at Target. Yeah. So, so here we are. Here we are uh -huh. doing our puzzle. All right, you guys. So let's share what made us happy tonight. Brennan already went to bed. Katie already went to bed. She finished, um, 
editing her video, which is exciting. So she's has made a commitment, but she said this several times before, so I'm not sure you have to check it out. She's made a commitment that she would love to post on her channel more often. So this video is going to go up, I think, in a couple of days. Um, so anyway, it's been so much fun being home. I've been, um, today I totally grinded on my closet. I think I showed you that earlier in the beginning of the video. And I will show it to you when it's done. Oh, did you find it? This is the piece I've been looking for this whole time. Congratulations, oh, Brian. Oh, how gosh. satisfying. Look at you. <gasps> nice job, buddy. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Anyway, I was grinding on my closet. I will wait to show you that until it's finished. I ordered a few things for it today, including a runner carpet and um, a jewelry armoire and some things I got some hooks and that kind of junk. So anyway, that's all good. I'm so excited about that. And then um, okay. once that's done, which should be in a couple of days, I will then move on to the dining room and finishing up the kitchen, which is like a huge project. So anyway, uh, it's fun being home. It's going to be raining this next week, so it's a great time to do um, home projects. Mm -hmm. No landscaping. I'm going to have to wait for that. Uh, you guys, we have so many weeds. We were gone, as you know, for eight weeks in Florida. And it didn't really, it wasn't really sunny here, but it was really, really rainy. So everything is wicked green, and we've got weeds all over the joint. So um, I'm going to have to do some weeding, but not until I get my insides done, uh, mm -hmm. inside projects done. I guess I could go back and forth. I'll probably end up doing that. But anyway, mm -hmm. all right, we hope you guys had a wonderful day today. Ryan, what made you happy today? Um, Doing everything. I woke up kind of late, but... um. Got out, watch some cool stuff about history with Brennan, um, and then did some homework. Uh, went to the went to the beach. And we played spike ball with the boys. It is so fun and so addicting. Oh, I just sat on the remote. Um, <laughs> it's so fun and so addicting. So we just kept playing and switching out games for like two straight hours. And uh, me and shout out to Matthew, my partner, uh, have built a rivalry with Nate and James. Um, we beat them once or twice, and they're they're a little bit better than us, but it's always a close game at the end. And uh, anyway, yeah, so it's playing spike ball with you <laughs> and doing this puzzle. All right. And getting a lot of work done. Yes, you got your homework done. And what? we're going, tomorrow we're going to our mid's graduation. Yes, another mid. mid's graduation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So yeah, Very I'm exciting. really excited for that. I am too. I am too. Mm -hmm. All right, sounds like you had a good day. Yeah. Excellent. All right, what made me happy today was making huge progress on my closet. That was really awesome. And I spent a lot of good time with um, all three kids. Mike left today to go on a business trip. He'll be back in a couple of days. So that wasn't fun saying goodbye to him, but he'll be back. Oh, yeah. And <clears throat> sometimes we do activities while he's gone that he doesn't huh? appreciate while he's here. Like puzzles. Like puzzles. <laughs> all right, you guys, comment down below what made you guys happy today. We cannot wait to see and read what, it, what you guys are doing at this time. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Oh, wait. Guess what I forgot. I forgot to show you sweet Alice. Oh, of course. Sweet Alice. Oh. Hi, sweet Alice. Are you sweet? <laughs> you beautiful girl. Yes, she's my lovey dovey. Mm, I love you. I love you. Yes, I know. I know, and you love me too. Mm, I know. It makes me so happy. Look at her smiling. Oh, baby girl. All right, good night. Say, say, comment below. What made you guys happy today? We'll see you tomorrow. Mom, Bye. That's what I said. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later. Thank you.